It's a good day for chainsaws and wood, too. On the deck with me. Jamie, I'm going to start with you first. This is an event you said that carvers go to, mainly chainsaw carvers, but all car carvers of all sorts. And uh, this has opened the public for the first time. So tell us why you opened it up. Uh, well, it's been four years in the making. It's our fourth year, and it's always been open to public, but we uh, decided to uh, publicize it a little bit more. It's been growing. Uh, we've developed a sculpture garden over the years, uh -huh. and it's really neat for people to walk through. They can see it, uh, and uh, you know, we're trying to raise some money for some uh, local charities and stuff like that also. Oh, so it's a win-win. Show us a couple of the, uh, the sculptures that we have here. This, this is gorgeous. I'm a, I'm a fan of frogs, I have to say. I really am. Yeah, maybe uh, a toad. I don't well, know. this was carved by Karita, uh, uh, one of the Japanese carvers. Uh -huh. uh, actually, all three of these were. Oh, no kidding. Um, and uh, he's since uh, yesterday we put him on a plane back to Japan. But um, these were all carved by him. They're 100% chainsaw. Um, just uh, amazing stuff, amazing work. It's delicate for a chainsaw. That's yeah. what, that's the really impressive part about that. And it's small. People are used to seeing, you know, uh, larger stuff. Uh, you know, it's, it's really small, something you would... Uh, possibly see from a hand carver, you know, hand carver. And as you said, you got folks from Japan helping out with this, but uh, you've got more international people here and joining me. We've got Ian from <laughs> Wales. Ian, what are you doing here in northeast Wisconsin? Well, it's just one of those, really. It's You get the invites from the guys uh -huh. in the carving family, really. Sure. And we, we, um, we turn the favor and invite them back over to the UK. Have you been here before? Is this the first nope. time? First time in Wisconsin. Uh, have you been enjoying yourself? I've loved every minute. You have? Honestly. You so have. friendly. Excellent. Now, you've been working on uh, what looks to be like a bear. Right now, at this point in time, it's a little bit square yep. for a bear. A bit blocked out. <laughs> but uh, quickly, uh, Jamie, tell us uh, where and when you can uh, see everyone carving and see all of the great finished products as well. Uh, all weekend, Saturday and Sunday, 10 till 6. Uh, People can stop by, and uh, all the carvers will be there. They'll start carving probably about 9 a.m. And uh, but uh, public's welcome to come out 10 to 6 every day. And uh, you're Saturday located at Sunday, uh, Abrams, Wisconsin. Okay. Uh, just take the Abrams exit, follow the East Frontage Road all the way down. All the way down, and uh, the name of the store that it's at? Uh, it's Sculpture by Dorn. Okay. But there'll be signs that say Carbapalooza and. It's easy to find. Well, you know what? It's fun to talk about it, but it's a lot more fun to see it being done. Ian, no I'm going to let you take it away, and I'm going to get out of the way. As we're going to demonstrate as I fall down. <laughs> Did you like that? Almost fall down. A little bit of chainsaw carving here. Eye protection, that's the key. Well, it really does have a nice little touch with that chainsaw. Angela, I'll let you take it away. 